Good morning, everyone. It's Saturday, September 10th. I'm Sarah Cody. Thank you so much for joining us. We will get to all of those top stories in just a moment. But first, meteorologist Ashley Baylor is here with our local forecast first. Beautiful, clear, cool morning when I got in the car. And what a, what a moon. Oh, that moon rising last night beautiful, was beautiful. Actually, thank you. Now, King Charles has formally been proclaimed king after his mother, Queen Elizabeth II, died on Thursday. She was the longest serving monarch of England. And right now we are taking a live look in London as King Charles has officially been named the next heir during the Ascension Council. And we're learning that President Biden is expected to attend the Queen's funeral. Here's ABC's Faith Abube with the latest. And a Meriden police officer will not be charged in an off-duty shooting. The inspector general found Officer Eric Simonson was justified in shooting Kenneth Struthers in February of last year. Welcome back, everyone. Fair and festival season is in full swing, and there are a bunch of big events happening all across the state this weekend. Here are eight things to do. The Connecticut Maritime Heritage Festival returns to Waterfront Park. All right, John, thank you. Now, Ashley, it's a big weekend. We got UConn, we got Syracuse, we got the Patriots on Sunday. You're going to be busy. Uh, yeah, I'm, well.